Welcome to today's video on a topic that's shaping the future of technology and global politics. China versus the US, the new Cold War in technology. The Cold War, a term traditionally associated with ideological and military rivalry between the US and the Soviet Union, seems to have found a new chapter in the realm of technology with China and the US at the forefront. The world's two largest economies are now locked in a fierce battle for dominance in emerging technologies such as artificial intelligence, 5G, and semiconductors. This is not just about innovation, it's about national security, economic power, and global influence. Uh, so uh, how did we get here? Let's rewind and understand the dynamics behind this high-stakes rivalry. The rivalry between China and the US in the technology sector has been intensifying over the past few decades. The rise of China's technological capabilities, especially in AI and telecommunications, has made the US feel threatened. One of the key starting points of this rivalry can be traced back to 2001, when China joined the World Trade Organization, WTO. This move allowed China to become a central hub for manufacturing technology products, boosting its economy and tech industry. Since then, China has invested heavily in its tech sector, setting ambitious goals to become a global leader in innovation. The Chinese government's Made in China 2025 initiative focused on advancing critical technologies, including robotics, aerospace, and electric vehicles. On the other side of the world, the US has historically been the home of some of the most innovative companies, including Apple, Google, and Microsoft. But as China made strides, the US began to view this as a strategic challenge. In 2018, the US government officially labeled China as a strategic competitor in its national defense strategy. The US began to take steps to limit China's access to crucial technologies, primarily focusing on China's biggest tech company, Huawei. Huawei, a global leader in telecommunications and 5G technology, became a focal point of tension between the two countries. The US government accused Huawei of espionage and banned American companies from selling vital technology to it. This ban raised global concerns as Huawei's 5G infrastructure was deployed in many countries. By 2001, Huawei was the world's largest supplier of 5G equipment, with 91 countries using its tech in some capacity. In retaliation, China ramped up its efforts to develop homegrown technologies, particularly in the semiconductor industry. The country launched ambitious plans to reduce its dependency on foreign chips and boost its own manufacturing capabilities the US, however, still holds a dominant position in the semiconductor market. As of 2021, US companies like Intel, AMD, and Qualcomm were responsible for producing over 50% of the world's advanced semiconductors. This technological arms race is not limited to just hardware. AI has become a critical battleground with both China and the US vying for supremacy in artificial intelligence research and development. In 2020, China's investment in AI surpassed 20 billion, with the government backing numerous AI-focused initiatives. The country aims to become the global leader in AI by 2030, setting an ambitious goal to develop a one trillion AI industry. In the US, companies like Google, Microsoft, and Amazon are making massive strides in AI, particularly in cloud computing and machine learning. The US government also views AI as a key component of national security, investing heavily in AI research and development. This race to dominate AI technology has sparked concerns about privacy, cybersecurity, and ethical implications. Uh, both countries are pushing the boundaries of what AI can do, but they are also developing AI for military applications, including autonomous weapons and surveillance systems. The rivalry between China and the US in technology also has major implications for global supply chains. China's role as the manufacturing powerhouse for electronic devices, including smartphones and laptops, has made it a crucial player in the global tech industry. 
However, the US has taken steps to limit China's access to advanced technologies, particularly in the semiconductor and telecommunications sectors. This has led to a significant shift in global supply chains with companies looking for alternatives to Chinese manufacturing. In response, China has been diversifying its supply chains and accelerating its own technological development. The country has focused on building domestic industries, from chip manufacturing to high-speed rail, reducing its reliance on foreign suppliers. The global implications of this tech cold war are not just economic. The US and China are also competing for political influence. The two countries are vying for leadership in global standards, from 5G to the Internet of Things, uh, IoT. In 2021, the US launched the Clean Network Initiative to encourage countries to adopt secure and trusted 5G infrastructure, excluding Chinese companies like Huawei. This initiative aimed to prevent China from dominating global technology standards. China has responded with its own initiatives, such as the Digital Silk Road, which aims to expand China's technological influence in countries across Asia, Africa, and Europe. Through investments in infrastructure, China is trying to set its own standards for digital technologies. The growing tensions between China and the US in technology are also affecting the broader global market. For example, tech companies in countries like India and Japan have faced pressure to choose sides, either aligning with US-led technologies or adopting Chinese solutions. In the cloud computing sector, for instance, Amazon Web Services, AWS, Microsoft Azure, and Google Cloud dominate the US market, while China's Alibaba Cloud is emerging as a serious competitor. The competition between these giants is expected to shape the future of cloud infrastructure. The rivalry between China and the US in technology is not just about economic power, it's also about geopolitical strategy. Both countries view control over advanced technologies as critical to maintaining global influence. While the US and China may be at the forefront of this tech cold war, the competition is also shaping the future of technology for the rest of the world. Smaller countries and emerging markets are being forced to pick sides and adopt either US or Chinese technologies. Thanks for watching today's video on China versus the US the new Cold War in technology. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe for more updates on the ongoing tech rivalry and other important topics.